Sophie, the Duchess of Edinburgh, recently had an awkward moment during her visit to Brock Hill Performing Arts College in Kent. While presenting the facility with the Leaf Education Demonstration School Gold Award, Sophie decided to give a lesson on family trees to the students. However, things took an unexpected turn when she drew the raw family tree on a whiteboard. Sophie started off by drawing little faces, including King Charles III, Princess Anne, Prince Andrew and her own husband, Ed. But when it came to adding King Charles's children, Sophie stopped after drawing William, leaving Prince Harry suspiciously absent. Don't worry though, it wasn't a deliberate snub. Sophie just focused on the direct succession line to the throne. During her visit, Sophie also managed to squeeze in some time with the animals on the farm. She even helped the students plant a tree while still wearing her stylish off-white red and navy check blazer by Me Plus M. But let's be real here, those dove grey suede high heels Mary Janes probably weren't the best choice of footwear for the muddy terrain. Sophie is known for her impeccable fashion sense and this visit was no exception. Her blazer is a fresh, trans-seasonal pattern that covers soft, mid-weight tailoring and it cleverly gives the illusion that it's pink from a distance. It's no wonder she's worn it before as it's a timeless piece that can be dressed up or down. Sophie completed her look with a simple white shirt left unbuttoned at the neck, chunky silver drop stud earrings, a thin silver chain and her wedding and engagement rings. Her highlighted locks were styled in a soft, half-up, half-down style that perfectly flattered her pretty features. But fashion isn't Sophie's only focus. She is a huge advocate for young people, recognising the importance of creating opportunities to enable them to reach their full potential. As patron of over 70 charities and organisations, Sophie is committed to supporting young people and inspiring them to make a positive impact on the world. That's why it's so fitting that she was there to present the LEAF Education Demonstration School Gold Award, which aims to engage, inspire and motivate young people through work-based learning. The charity gives future generations a balanced and informed insight into food production, farming and the environment, and Sophie was proud to be part of it. During her visit, Sophie got up close and personal with the animals who live on the farm. She even shared a tender moment with a young calf who was being groomed by one of the students. Later on, she watched as some of the younger students learned how to pull sheep wool through a machine in order for it to be turned into yarn. It was a hands-on experience that allowed Sophie to connect with the students and learn more about the work they're doing. All in all, Sophie's visit to Brockhill Performing Arts College was a success. She may have had an awkward moment with the family tree, but she made up for it by being her usual charming self. And let's not forget her impeccable fashion sense, which added a touch of elegance to the whole affair. Sophie's commitment to young people and education is inspiring, and we can't wait to see what she'll do next.